Psychology researchers say that hope is the single most important feeling that we can have and that it's necessary for our mental health. Yet many people found their hope being tested as they struggle to make their dreams a reality, especially during a pandemic. Here to help us on this Mental Health Monday is licensed clinical social worker and psychotherapist Heather Hans. Heather, good morning. Good morning, Gary. Thank you for having me. Sure. So why is hope so important? Hope is the awareness that goals can be achieved and goals give us momentum to keep living. It's different than wishful thinking, which is more of an escape from reality. Hope acknowledges the real and hard obstacles on the path to reaching goals, but it motivates us to stick with it. And just like we need regular exercise to stay healthy, we need to constantly work at having hope. And so what are the steps to finding hope? What should people be doing out there? First is to envision a specific personal or professional goal. Clarify exactly what you want and get a visual image of it in your mind. People can also create a visual reminder for their physical space where they'll see it every day. You set the, the bar high yet doable and look for examples of people who have done what you wanna do. Next is to create multiple pathways to reach the goal. Uh, the more people know what it will take to reach the goal, the higher their odds of success. Research shows that when people work towards a goal without knowing what they're up against, they often become hopeless and fail, whereas the ones who understand the obstacles are happier and can even surpass the goal. So be realistic, consider the obstacles, and plan for contingencies. Psychotherapists can help people create new goals in cases where the old one is no longer a possibility. And then finally, be willing to do the work. Pathways are about finding ways to reach the goal. Next, it's about taking action using willpower, and both are needed for hope. So some things that strengthen willpower are delaying gratification, allowing yourself intermittent periods of relaxation, and good self-care. Yeah, I was gonna say that those all make a lot of sense, but those are kind of for the long haul, I would guess. So, so many people have been struggling with this pandemic. Are there any quick ways people can find hope, say in a moment? Absolutely. Watch funny videos. Humor and funny videos have been shown to increase hopefulness quite a bit because they suppress our negative thought patterns and allow us to come up with new creative pathways to success. Another thing is to give hope to others. Remind them of their past successes because when we give hope, it creates just as much pleasure in the brain as when we receive it. All right. All good advice. Heather, thank you for joining us. It's always nice to see you. Thank you so much for having me. Okay.